My name is Andrew Liebelt. I'm a member of the of the 2007 senior class at Derm Academy. Um, if I could change one thing about the use of technology at DA, it would be to make it easier to use for everyone, almost as if it was open source, except it was hardware. Um, I would hopefully break down any kind of monetary border. If someone couldn't afford an Apple, they had to use a PC and vice versa. Um, basically make everything available to everyone. Um, if I could add a technological resource, if I could dream big, I would have to say personal computers or the equivalent for everyone, and those computers would be used by everyone or be able to interface with everyone. Um, outside of school, um, t uh, the technology I use uh, has to do more with listening to music and making movies and viewing pictures, that kind of thing, media. Um, I don't program anymore. Um, I would say basically word, uh, word processors more than anything for school. Um, I'd love to be able to see the use of converting paper documents easily into uh, digital text. Um, is, and even more important, I think in some ways, uh, digital or images um, on paper. Yeah. I can think of one something that's really important. Yeah. Um, I had, my brother had a lot of difficulty, uh, or my, my mother had a lot of difficulty with my brother helping him with his work after school because it's not easy for a teacher to photocopy every single resource they use and give it to the parent. And having the ability for the parent to use everything that's being used in the classroom, I think would be just absolutely worth its weight in gold mm -hmm. for parents who maybe aren't quite computer literate or maybe aren't quite is advanced in the studies that the students use. Um, I think that would be huge uh, for the parents to be able to use that. Um, do you think that it would it would um, that that teachers should have a web presence, meaning um, there should be some information so that if you don't have that piece of paper that was given to you because you've lost it, that you can retrieve it somewhere? Do you think that that is an important um, thing to have? I think that's essential. I think that. Um, it takes out the whole my dog ate my homework excuse. I mean, there's no there's no excuses for missing um, for not having the right materials when you're at home. Um, it allows anyone to use material. Like I said, if it's your parents who would like to help you along with that, they have the material. Or, and more importantly, if let's say you left your copy at home, you've, or you left your copy at school, you've got it at home, and vice versa. That's completely essential. There's no there's no, no more late excuses for I forgot mine. My name is Allison Cole, and I'm in the eighth grade here at Durham Academy. And um, if I could change one thing about the use of technology at Durham Academy, um, in the long term, I think it would be really nice to have laptops just because I type a lot faster than I write, and it would be a lot easier for me to do note taking. And uh, I know it would also be helpful if I had my textbooks on a computer. Um, because carrying around so many textbooks is really hard on my back. And I think in the long term it's probably something that we're looking at, but I know that I would prefer a Mac over a PC just because I've worked on both and I like Mac a lot better because of the programs that I use on it. And I, um, I really like the smart boards that we have in the computer labs. It would be really nice if we had those in all the classrooms because we use projectors in a lot of the classrooms and there's always problems with them. The light bulbs going out and the, uh, in math, I remember one time the screen fell down and it's just a lot of trouble. You're talking about projectors or um, overhead? You mean overhead projectors? Where you put the transparency on. Outside of school, I use the technology of, um, I have, I have a laptop um, that I've had for a few years that I don't use as often now because I have a uh, desktop Mac. I also use an iPod and a cell phone. Um, I usually have them with me pretty much wherever I go. Um, I would love to be able to use, um, I guess just coming back to the laptop um, thing, it would just, it would be much easier for me if it was integrated with the classes and I could use it more. I could, I don't, it just, it would be a lot easier if I could do most of my work on the computer. I already type up all my assignments, but if it was fully integrated with the class, it would 
probably be a lot easier. Do you think that students would be responsible enough to take care of, the la of a laptop? Um, I think that a laptop is, um, it's not the same thing as, you know, the way that kids lose their binders or their textbooks. I think that a lot of the students would, um, they would sort of learn to take care of their laptop. And um, it might even help to teach some responses. Hi, my name is David Jackson, and I'm in the sixth grade at Durham Academy. And I'm here to talk about, talk to you about what I think of technology. And I think that in the long term, I would hope that each student at Durham Academy would have a laptop for their own work. And if possible, I think getting PDAs or tablets or anything like that would be really useful. And for recording my own information, I would use the laptop or the PDA and then I could access that anywhere and then anytime and I could work on anything from school that I wanted. And I think I'd feel most comfortable with Mac laptops just because that's what I've grown up with and I find them more comfortable, more easy to work with and better for the educational curriculum than PCs. And I also think that at school, um, I think that we should use technology in our classes more. Currently, the only class that I use computers in on a regular basis is LA class, and I think that Durham Academy has extremely good technology, and I think that we should take advantage of that and use that technology more. How do you think students would treat and take care of a laptop? I think that we might have a few problems with, say, them, you know, I noticed that with some kids, cell phones, books, they'll just drop them on the ground, leave them out on the sidewalk, and mm -hmm. unless they were told specifically and maybe forcefully that they had to really take care of this thing, because it's, I mean, I don't want to say that books are not important, but it's not like a book, it costs maybe $2,000, so you drop it, you break it. And right, it, it is different. Um, what's been the best part about blogging and using Class Blogmeister? Um, being able to put comments on other students' work and reading their work. So, so that the fact you can get feedback and give feedback and really, yeah, yeah, great, awesome. Thank you.